In the last video, we studied the radiation pattern of a dipole antenna. So in this video, we will learn and find the radiation pattern for a Yagi Uda antenna. So let's get started. To perform this experiment, we would use the exact same setup from the last video. So if you haven't watched that video yet, make sure that you watch it now. The link is in the description. Now, in this experiment, we would change the receiver antenna to Yagi Uda. But before we do that, let's make sure that antenna is set up to the antenna design standards, which is basically setting up this director section to 10 cm on both sides and 11 cm on both sides. Now, setting the feed to 12 cm and finally setting the reflector to 13 cm would complete our setup for this antenna. Once the antenna is set up, let's replace the receiver antenna which we used in the last experiment from dipole to Yagi Uda in this experiment. Now, to do that, let's recall the procedure from the last time. That is step number 1 setting up the antenna, step number 2 setting up the transmitter and receiver bands, step number 3 orienting the angle at the receiver to 0 degree, and step number 4 orienting the transmitter and receiver both in the same orientation that is horizontal. And lastly, step number 5 keep the transmitter and receiver at a distance of 2 meters. Once this is done, switch the antenna trainer kit on and note the readings for every 5 degree angle until we complete a 1 360 degree rotation. Once we note the readings, we have to plot them on a radial graph to obtain the radiation pattern of given antenna. So guys, that's how you could use your radiation pattern to study the antenna characteristics and uh, to find out the radiation pattern of any given antenna. So guys, see you in the next video.